Knowledge Enhancer Quizzes presents MS PowerPoint Quiz 1 Question number 1. In order to edit a chart, you can A. Triple click the chart object B. Click and drag the chart object C. Double click the chart object D. Click the chart object Option C is the right answer. Question number two. If you have a PowerPoint show you created and want to send using email to another teacher, you can add the show to your email message as a and dash. A. Inclusion. B. Attachment. C. Reply. D. Forward. Option B is the right answer. Question number three. You can create a new presentation by completing all of the following except dash. A. Clicking the new button on the standard toolbar. B. Clicking file, new. C. Clicking file, open. D. Pressing control plus N. Option C is the right answer. Question number four. Material consisting of text and numbers is best presented as dash. A. A table slide. B. A bullet slide. C. A. Title slide. D. All of above. Option A is the right answer. Question number 5. To select one hyperlink after another, during a slide presentation, what do you press? A. Tab. B. Control plus K. C. Control plus H. D. All of above. Option A is the right answer. Question number six. Which file format can be added to a PowerPoint show? A. JPG. B. GIF. C. WAVE. D. All of above. Option D is the right answer. Question number seven. Which of the following should you use, if you want all the slide in the presentation, to have the same, look? A. The slide layout option. B. Add a slide option. C. Outline view. D. A. Presentation design template. Option D is the right answer. Question number 8. In Microsoft PowerPoint, two kind of sound effects files that can be added to the presentation are dash. A. Wave files and mid files. B. Wave files and GIF files. C. Wave files and JPG files. D. JPG files and GIF files. Option A is the right answer. Question number 9. What is a motion path? A. A type of animation entrance effect. B. A method of advancing slides. C. A method of moving items on a slide. D. All of above. Option C is the right answer. Question number 10. In the context of animations, what is a trigger? A. An action button that advances to the next slide. B. An item on the slide that performs an action when clicked. C. The name of a motion path. D. All of above. Option B is the right answer. How many of them did you answer correctly? Tell us in the comments section below. Thanks for watching.